I love it when you get a guy who doesn't like being on camera and then you just like totally come in here and you like ruin everything. So everybody, this is the faceless. Like, see, you just outed you. Man, I totally like it's like doxed you. Like, no, me. You know, I was like, maybe I should blur his face. I don't know. Anyway, all right, let me let me put my back deck down. This is real. I love doing this real. The music's finally turned down. I'm doing a quickie. Hear it. Respect arms move. Um, is that a backwards? What is that? A backwards Z? Is that a Z? Your name is Z in it? Which one? Which one? What's that? Yeah. It's a Z. Yeah. It's a Z. It's cool. The name is Z. Anyway, it's a, it's, a, it's a tongue twister for uh, for Americans and Brits and everybody who yeah. uses English now. Uh, I'm from Poland, so what is your special power? What is your, what is your special power? power? Yeah. I can speak Polish. <laughs> I can speak really bad Mandarin. Oh, I can speak really nice Polish. There you go. That's about the extent. And I, that, no, that, I don't have any superpowers. <laughs> Mine's talking to people on the internet, but that's also your superpower. That's also your superpower. So we've yeah, got like triple. Com comparing to you, mine sucks. <laughs> anyway, why are we talking about this? We're at the Boo <laughs> Respect to Arms. If you guys don't know who Respect to Arms is, they're a company out of, well, Poland, and they actually hold the Rock River Arms license on their products. Uh, it's been mainly like, you might know from the European side of the world uh, from doing their releases there, but we're seeing it now stateside and globally. Like everywhere I go, like I go to trade shows in Asia, I go everywhere I turn, I see Respect to Arms, and there's a good reason. There are not just going to the same places in OEM from the same factories. They are doing a lot of special stuff, including, the big thing is, gates pre-installed. So we're looking at gate uh, MOSFETs in these. So we're gonna look at there, they have two tiers. They have the edge line, which is their high-end line, metal with deep edge engravings, nice rails, all that, like metal, 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 all the way through. And then we also have the core line, which you're gonna see like this, polymer, much more budget friendly. They share a lot of the same features, including quick change spring systems that are true. You're gonna be out the back, like you actually just pull off the buffer tube and, and change the spring from there. You don't actually have to take the mech box out of the shell. They got this really cool system I wanna show you. Here, I need your hand. Show me the motor change system. I got Vanna White here. So look at this, this motor change right here. Check it out. Get the squeezy squeeze. He's kind of doing a weird angle. All right, there you go. You can now, there you go. So your motor connector comes off. Yeah, motor connector comes off. You can easily just fix it right there. Tool is, you can still adjust the motor height with an Allen key, but the actual access to it is that. That was it, really did it. Get two uh, on these, you get two big caps in the box. And they're coming right now with the XASR, ASR, right? XASR? XASR, I got it right, of uh, the, um, the gate. But coming up soon, they're gonna have the Aster which is gonna be the optical trigger version. Uh, it's gonna be going in these, and you're gonna have an optional to even take it all the way up to a Titan, Gate Titan pre-installed. And this is the Aster as it comes down in between, probably out of focus. This is the Aster V2. It's a single board, so you don't have that, and there's no moving parts because it uses optical sensor. So basically when you pull the trigger, the trigger passes the sensor in here and it tells the gun to fire. That's it. Now these are gonna be programmable. They're gonna have, um, the, there's a the card. Where's that programming card? Let me steal it. Here we go. Let's see, is this in focus? Tell me if this is in focus now. All right, that's all the stuff it does. Just hit pause if you don't know. There you go. You got it? Back? There we go, right there. See, I love having a camera assistant. Somebody who does good stuff. Cards back to you. So that's it. Like I said, on the core, on the, um, the core side, we're looking at still the quick change system for the grip and the spring on the cores. But on this, you're gonna have uh, basically a much more budget build. So if you want to kind of get started in their line and then work your way up, you have that option. So you have kind of everything along the lines of the tiers. Most of it's in four platform, different rail options. And I said Rock River Arms licensing. By the way, this guy does some of the best videos. I'm going to link his... Oh, yes, stop. Do. Come on, you got... They're like second best. No, they're not. No, they're not. No, they're not. They're hilarious. What, what, what channel should I put them on YouTube? Where should I point them for your uh, videos? Gunfire TV. So, yeah, the uh, Gunfire TV stuff. Like, I just want to make sure oh, I'm going to say it right. You can just write down tactical and this. This, this. Yeah, he's not going to yeah. pronounce his... I love it. He didn't pronounce his name. So, yeah, check it out. Like, definitely go to Gunfire TV. Uh, like, I'm, like, seriously, some of your stuff's just absolutely off the chain. Anyway, we're going to go. Uh, you've seen enough here. Check it out if you guys haven't done this. Definitely worth a look. This is one of the like, why haven't we seen this before moments in Airsoft. Anyway, let's come on. And by the way, Random Guy Kev, if you guys are not subbed to this guy, you need to smash, smash that sub button. Smash it. Like, just beat it. Like, just like, don't break your screen because I don't want to be responsible for a broken LCD. <laughs> I'll bring but you food. LED. Yeah, oh, he'll bring you food. I'll bring you food. So we hear it right now. So he'll bring you food. Guys, go ahead and put your food orders <laughs> down in the comment section below. Like, straight up, it's like Kev's DoorDash. Is, is Kev's DoorDash? Kev's DoorDash.com? Yeah. Kev's okay, cool. Cool, that's it. Anyway, <laughs> see you guys. So stay tuned. We're going to have more stuff from the uh, Airsoft Con here 2019 here at EVIC. <laughs>